Once again, we are joined live in studio with David William Sims, who plays under the name Unfact. Thank you very much, David, for coming in. This is Radio K's Now Like Photographs. Thank you, Will. It was my pleasure. Uh, so I'd like to start off for any fans who aren't familiar with your previous work or just to give a good sketch of where this music is coming from. Do you think you could give a quick little like medium length bullet point history of your music career? Uh, let's see. I was in a band a long time ago called Scratch Acid that played in Minneapolis a couple times. And I was in a band called the Jesus Lizard that played in Minneapolis a lot. Uh, and uh, since then, I've done a few other things. Um, did uh, a project, uh, a thing last year with Reese Chatham. Uh, and did a tour with Sparkle Hole, just various other things. Probably, certainly best known for the Jesus Lizard. Definitely. So that's kind of uh, where I'm going to bring the next question. Um, and I don't mean this in a, a very superficial way, but what are some of the advantages and disadvantages of composing music in a very different format as a solo band just playing ambient instrumental uh, music compared to a full band setup? Um, well, there are disadvantages. I mean, there's definitely sort of a, a moral moral support system that comes along with being in a band. And uh, that can be nice. You know, when you have an off show, you sort of know that everybody else is covering for you. Where when you're doing the solo thing and uh, you're screwing up, I can say screwing up, right? When you're screwing up, it's like, Hey everybody, this is what it sounds like when I'm really screwing up, and uh, that can be disheartening. But uh, yeah, the solo thing's definitely a lot weirder than being in a band. I guess it is if you're used to playing in bands for years and years, and then are just doing the solo thing for the first time, uh, which I, I did just just start a few months ago. Um, so now that you're you're doing your own project, why would you go in? the direction of, like I said, sort of droning ambient, often very spacey, rather than the the very direct style of music that was the Jesus Lizard? Well, that direct style, you know, so much of that, you know, is, I guess, for one thing, just the, doing the solo stuff, it just lends itself to that, I think, just naturally. I mean, the driving thing, you know, it starts with a drummer, and, and that's very integral to that. And, uh, and I just enjoy that kind of music, and, and I've kind of heard other people do it and want to do it, and it just makes sense to do it that way uh, solo. Uh, you've been involved in the experimental music scene for a very long time. I'll call Jesus Lizard experimental. Um, so I imagine you have a very interesting perspective on this group of musicians you play with. So I wanted your input in maybe for the listeners as well who are some of your favorite peers in the genre you play in um not only uh be prepared for some serious scare quotes the snot-nosed kids as well as the old war horses right i mean as far as like the 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 more experimental solo stuff you know i really uh i like th uh, thrones like joe preston's project and of course noveller who i'm on tour with and we playing with this evening uh and uh, you know a lot of like the Reese Chatham stuff, and then uh, what was the rest of the question? I think you covered it. Okay. Um, and I have just one question left for you. Uh, what is in the future for Unfact? Do you have any recordings that you're working on? Yeah, I'd like to record. I mean, I'm trying to get it together to record an actual album, like release a CD or, or something like that in the next couple of months i'd like to get it out in time i'm gonna go and do a tour in november with aiden baker uh and noveller um so hopefully you know i'm trying to like scramble and get that out in time for that uh we'll we'll, we'll see if i can actually pull that off definitely looking forward to it here okay uh, thank you very much david for coming in again if you're just joining us we have unfact in studio k so radio k is now like photographs whenever you're ready i believe you have one more song for us